everybody, it's Mocha D and I am back with some poetry for you guys. Haven't done poetry in a while, but this poem resonates with me so much because it's about insecurities and finding yourself through those insecurities. And I'm all about that. And um, just to be close and honest, I wanted to tell you an insecurity of mine. My insecurity is cellulite. So I'm, I work out. Like, you see, cellulite for me is just, ugh, I hate cellulite. I mean, I just do. And I wish my stomach was way more flatter. I know some people are like, oh, your stomach is flat, da, da, da. But, you know, this is without spanks, all of that, just natural. But I just, I sometimes wish that. Um, and fighting through those insecurities. So I'm going to start off with the poem right now. Feel the sun beam on your chest. Feel the love that made your heart complex. Your heart is racing. Fitness saved me. No longer was I confused on me and who was going to save me. Who was better than you? I cried many nights in this quiet place. But then the sweat and the tears and late night dates, I found a place where people lose their soul. But when you run, you run until you find your perfect place. It's only the quiet place where you can find embrace. It's in the choice you make, choosing to love and accept what you cannot change and what might be fake. We're living in a world where everyone wants the perfect shape, but only a few do what it truly takes. Feel the sun drop down your chest, the sweat, because only through self-love you will find your ideal fate. Yes. Um, so yes, insecurities. Um, I think I, I disclosed some insecurities in the very beginning. And, you know, some people might say, well, wow, you look good and da 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 da. But you know what? We all have them. We all have them. We all have insecurities that we're like, we wish we could change. And I feel like through self-love is the only way you fix your insecurities. I mean, when I, before I met my partner that I'm with now, I really did evaluation of my life. I mean, I've cried. And not because I didn't love myself, but because I was never used to being in the situation I was in. I was never used to being single. I was never used to being alone and not, you know, um, having someone there at one point or another. So I'm 30, you know, the beginning of my 20s. Of course, I lived with my mom. Then I got married and I lived with my husband. And then I moved back with my mom after my separation. And then... um moved in with my ex at that time we were together for two years and then two years living with each other so at that time i was that was like when we first broke up that was like the first time i had to pay bills be independent and i used that time to like focus on me and i'm glad i did because anytime i'm feeling like anxious or insecure or like i remember that i am good enough and when you find that you are good enough, believe me, baby girl, it is empowering. Sometimes I read my own poem, my old poems of when I was going through that. And I'm like, so I just want to hug her now. And it's literally like a year later. And I just want to hug her now. Because I'm like, girl, you made it. So if there's anything that th that that teaches you is that insecurities are real. But loving yourself heals all of that. And there are always going to be things that you're not going to like. Especially when people do surgeries. They say, you know, I just then I didn't like this. And I tried to fix that. Then I didn't like that. And I tried. I always say there's always going to be things about you that you don't like. And exercising channels that for me. Because I can, if I don't like the cellulite, I work out on my legs more intensely. If I want my stomach to be flatter, I think about that while I'm doing my 200 crunches. I'm like, ah. And people are like, you have abs. Like, why? what are you worried about, about girl? Once you're great, be greater. And once your greatness has got to greater, be excellent. And once you're excellent, do it all over again. It's Mocha D, and I'm tuning out. Love you guys mucho.